Hello, I'm Sig Solo. Welcome to my channel. Today is the Tuesday shave and it's actually a cheat shave because today is the 5th of July. So yesterday for your Americans were uh, the 4th of July. So I guess you had a lot of celebrations yesterday for me and for my family. Uh, the 4th was the day we had my daughters. Uh, yesterday was the day we had uh, my daughter's confirmation party with all the guests and all that. So this is a pre-recorded -reco uh, shave because I'm not sure that I will be able to actually do a shave and a video on the 5th because of all the partying. I might be exhausted, I might be hungover, I don't know. I hardly ever drink. This is actually recorded on the 19th. Um, so a good uh, two weeks before or more than that even. And today's Father's Day. So I'm doing my Father's Day shave because today is Father's Day. And before I get into the stuff I'm using, I want to show you what my daughter gave me. She asked me, what do you wish? Do you have any wishes for Father's Day? And I said, the usual stuff. Uh, I'm content as long as you're happy. And I said, she said, I want to give you something. And I said, well, something you made because she's very creative. And what she did was to make me a thumbs up. Thumbs up, you might think. Yes. She made me, in plaster, a thumbs up with my channel's colors on it and my channel and my name on it. So she made me a thumbs up for my channel, a six solo thumbs up. And I, <laughs> that's so clever. That's such a, sh a funny and good idea. Nothing in the world could have been better than that. So that's what my 14 year th years old uh, gave me. So that's just great. Today is the Father's Day shave uh, for me. Uh, and what my father, the smells I remember from my childhood, is my father using this stuff. The Old Spice. Unfortunately, I don't have the Old Spice soap, so I'm going with my Master Soap Creations, this wonderful piece of art label, by the way. It's called Vintage Spice. And this is for my nose, the closest to the vintage, the real Old Spice soap that I remember. And it's the closest to the aftershave. And this was made, of course, by Master Soap Creations. So Fernando, thumbs up for making this. So this has red on it. I went with the red Disco Devil handle, uh, Rich Man Shaving, Rich Hansen. Uh, one of a kind uh, red uh, shaving brush with the Ultralux, the best uh, badger not in existence, I think, and my Six Solo red. I chose this. I have a couple of red brushes. I chose this because I know how much uh, Rich misses his father and how much of a role model he was in his life and how much he had had a part in Rich taking up making brushes. So a thought goes out to you, uh, Rich, I know you miss your father immensely. I still have my father and I have spoken to him already today. So I'm using this in honor of you, Rich, and in honor, in honor of how your father got you started with all this. Okay, that's it. Four minutes almost, I'm sorry. The razor for today is the marvelous, the fantastic ATT, the above the tie SE1 um, single edge razor. And I have it here. It's the brushed matte finish, and I think it's gorgeous. And I have it with the Calypso XL handle. This was very kindly sent to me by Mariah from above the tie to try out. Uh, as I told you on a previous shave and on the unboxing uh, some while back, that they sent me this to try out after seeing my um, ugly stuff Windsor Pro video. I will link that below. So I will be trying this today and I had to go red. So I, I didn't have a red blade. Uh, so I went with the pink Captain Titan Mild from Kai because it says pink. And if you look closely, closely in the light, you can see that the titanium coating on the blade has a red rainbowish 
flair to it. I don't know if this is visible for, for the camera, but that's why I chose it. And because I got such a nice shape on the last shape of it. Okay, so let's get this party started. I'm sure I forgot to say something here, uh, but I hope that all you Americans had a great uh, 4th of July yesterday. Um, tell me what you did. Do you have any traditions? In my family we don't, but we are not Americans, of course. Um, tonight, because this is Father's Day, I'm getting a big steak. Uh, that's what I was promised, at least. So, a bit, a big, medium rare. Is that what you call it? Medium. Um, I don't want it bloody as hell, and I don't want it to be cooked. Like the sole of a shoe. The trick I learned when you are making a steak is to put your finger like this, not like this, but like this, and then feel here. That's how the steak should feel. If you do this, and then that's the, you know, not medium, but all, all the way through. And if you do this, it's the very rare. I don't know if that's true, but it works for me. Okay, so let's give this a go. Oh, this looks like I underwatered it, doesn't it? Let me just give myself a little more here. I got plenty of soap out of only half a teaspoon. No, quarter teaspoon, what does it say? It says, oh yeah, it says quarter teaspoon. So, okay, let's get this party started. Oh man. Straight away, I can tell you, this is a three day stopper by the way. Straight away, I can tell you, this reminds me of the fantastic X1. That is, that is one of my absolute favorite races I've ever tried. The above the tie. X1 Slant SE. I will link that in the description as well. I feel the blade. But nothing crazy. I don't remember if I told you, but this is 136, almost 137 grams. So, a wonderful. Oh, yeah, I opened up an old battle wound there. That's not the razor. And the handle is a four-inch handle, so the, everything is as the doctor prescribed. Oh, I think I got myself again there. I hit the very same spot. It's an old wound that I opened up, crossing a corner, you know, taking a shortcut over my lip the other day, you know, it's not the racist fault, but I tell you, I like this SE very much, and I need to remember to say this, 6 solo 71 is the code you can use on AT, ATT above the ties site and then get a 10% discount. You can also, and I will put that below, I got one of those funny links 
that you just click and then all the information about the Sixolo 71 is always put in as a discount code. So you can follow that link or you can just put in the Sixolo 71 when you order. If you're going there, by all means. If you're not, I'm not telling you to buy anything. But if you are, 10% is 10%. You know. But I'm very grateful that Mariah sent me these three razors. The Winsor Pro Aluminium, the X1 Slant SE, and then this one. The, you might call it the normal SE, the Artist Club SE. And this is a fantastic, fantastic feeling razor. Wonderful knurling. So everything is good here. Oh, wait a second. This is just so nice. So, what did you do for Father's Day? No, what did you do for 4th of July? Or, what did you do for Father's Day? Anything special? Any traditions to share? Did you get something special? Are you, did you get a steak like me? And for 4th of July, something to do with fireworks? If you are in the US, tell me in the comments. And also, what is your favorite SE? And in that regards, have you tried this? Man. This is up there with the Enoch from Occam's. This is up there with the slant, uh, above the Thai slant. And it's up there with the Yachi Raster V3. So. An effortless, nice feeling shape with the sense that my father used. I always struggle here because I'm a righty, so I cannot... Let's see. Let's just have a feel. As always, this soap works fantastic. Um, Fernando's soap is tallow based. Uh, just feel what way to go here. Fernando's soap turtle based and it gives you a residual sleepless night I don't know what it's a six ounce soap for $16 I think uh, so I have plenty of residual stickness here just in case okay and that's it Everything's good on my part here. So, man, man, man. Oh yeah, oh, no need to put that into the cloth. This is, as I said, when you lather the soap up, it becomes a seven out of 10 on the scent scale. And it is, to my nose, the closest to the aftershave uh, Old Spice that I remember from my childhood. And that's saying a lot. It took me right back to sitting on the top, or in the top, while my father was straight razor shading next to me. Of course, watching me, but using the time to get a great shave while I was sitting playing in the bathtub 
beside him. So, man, man, man. Eight CNC sh uh, shaving towel. Always available, and he delivers to the entire world, and he's a great, great guy. Oh, I have something in my teeth now. I apologize. Well, this is not a beauty channel. <laughs> so let me just see. Grab a toothpick. I'm sorry. But you need to flush your teeth. And it seems I didn't do that in a good enough way. I'm using the glass bottle here. This, I have two versions. This is made of a metallic plastic one. Uh, and it looks like the old label better. But this is in the glass bottle that my father would have used. Or used. And sometimes even use. So. Such a nice feeling. Fantastic. Man, man, man. Oh, yeah. So, the balm for today is the only one I have with an uh, old style scent. Is the Acrovelva Sensitive 5 in 1 balm. And I need to remember to only take a very little because otherwise I will have balm for days for the entire body so oh man oh, man that's a fantastic shave well a little a little something there but that's the result of like this cut up here of a rough shave the other day so i just opened up an old battle mold wasn't a race i tell you Okay, so, Six Solo is about to say I'm out, but I almost forgot. Like, subscribe, hit the bell and share. And you know why we do this? We do this because of this. Look at that. We are not obsessed. We are dedicated. Six Solo, out.